Hopefully my video can help you make that purchase decision. Welcome everyone to Jim's Review Room. Going over the physical features first, there's no question that this mouse is large. Comparing to other mice that I have here in the office as a size comparison, the 2S fills the palm the best. The medium-sized M705, I can indeed cup that entire thing here, and it's a great mouse nonetheless, but for long hours in front of the computer editing, the larger mouse with that huge thumb rest here does allow my hands to feel more relaxed. Now one thing I wish Logitech would improve is providing a stickier, much more grippy texture at the thumb area, and on the other side, where my ring and pinky finger rest to make it less slippery when handling that's something i missed on the mx performance mouse that they had way back in the day now some familiar features makes a return the hyper scroll wheel is perfect for large excel and word documents it's perfect for long web pages to scroll through them pretty quickly here you can toggle free flowing which i just showed you here or with the tap of the button right on the mouse you can have a click to click ratchet method for moving around it gives you a little bit more precision now for example if you're into photoshop utilizing these side scroll wheel here will move your workspace from left to right and vice versa it comes in handy from time to time the back and forward buttons that are found on other mice or other competitors is available to go back or forward on web pages which is super convenient but compared to many other mice i've used in the past including logitech having the buttons a bit bigger or simply moving the buttons directly above my thumb would be much easier than retracting my thumb each time to tap now there's a discrete button on the thumb rest when pressed. This brings up all of your windows for viewing at a glance and back to a single window pane when pressed again. Although all these features from the factory are useful for everyday use, with the free Logitech Options software, you can customize all of your buttons and have them perform certain shortcuts, have them perform certain keyboard shortcuts even. It's all customizable. Now from here on out in this video, this is where it gets really interesting. And personally for me, puts me at all. Within the Logitech Options software, you can have the buttons customized to a specific application, whether it be Google Chrome, whether you're using Adobe Photoshop or Premiere or even Microsoft Paint. You can customize your mouse and use the buttons as your predefined shortcuts. Now one example, if you copy and paste a lot, assign copy and paste to your back and forward buttons. Whenever you're working in Premiere, those buttons are used just for copy and pasting. But once I open, say, let's say Chrome, the mouse automatically changes to whatever I have set for the Chrome application. In this case, I left it as going back on pages and going forward on web pages uh, for my convenience. Now the mouse intuitively jumps back and forth in between settings as a jump in between apps or programs. Now moving on to other new and upgraded features and why you would consider buying this is the dark field mouse tracking. The original master had an up to 1600 DPI reading while the master 2S has an up to 4000 DPI reading making this a very sensitive mouse and a highly reactive mouse too to small movements. In your field of work you might just need that. The master is still capable of reading on practically all surfaces that you throw at it whether you're not using a mouse pad at all or using it on top of dull wood shiny veneer wood tables and even transparent glass that I've tested here again it all works now wireless range wise uh, I was able to achieve 27 linear feet before the mouse started to lose its signal now battery life has claimed to be improved as well with the original master lasting up to 40 days the new master 2s lasts up to 70 days and just being transparent I haven't had this mouse for the full 70 days so I can't say how long it's lasted so far but once the battery does die check the video description and I'll list what I achieved eventually now last up and we've seen this before you can have this mouse pair via Bluetooth and or the Logitech's unifying USB attachment three computers can be connected at the same time and can be switched between them uh, by pressing the button on the back of the mouse pretty straightforward and simple but again the 2s flexes its features list here once again with the introduction of Logitech flow download the software on your Windows and or Apple computer and have the mouse recognized by up to three computers again now you can seamlessly work across three computers at the same time. Now, very similar to having three monitors connected into one PC or one system, 
you can drag your mouse over to the second and third screen. You can share your keyboard across all three systems as well. Now, I tested copying files from one computer and pasting it onto another. That went without a hitch. The connection is based off of your home's network and not by Bluetooth or uh, with the USB unifier that Logitech provides. Now, I tested this with a 250 megabyte video file here and it had taken about a minute and a half to uh, fully copy over. Not lightning speed, not gigabit speeds though, but for the average consumer, faster than sending files through email or uploading to Dropbox and then re-downloading. Now, there are unfortunately limitations though, which does take away from this amazing idea. One, and this is not a deal breaker technically in my book here, but moving my mouse over to other screens, there is a slight one second delay before the mouse is responsive. Again, again, very minor. Now, second, I can't drag a file and drop it onto the other desktop. My files would stop at the edge of the screen and the mouse would continue to go across. And third, I can't have an open file such as a Word doc opened or a photo opened and dragged it over to the other screen slash computer as well. It somewhat removes that streamlined approach. Again, the only thing I can do is copy and paste all of this, but can't drag files over. So in the end here, the Master 2S is still one beast of a mouse. If you currently don't own the previous generation and are in need of a productivity mouse in general, for sure get this. It's a large, comfortable fit, tons of options, tons of features here. I love the custom setup for each program and it works seamlessly.